motherfucker. I'm gonna grab my damn camera, putting the bitch in there. <laughs> yep. Damn, that's crazy. So it fit right back over it. Bro, they'll, they'll never to... tell. They'll never tell, bro. Tell about the bitch? <laughs> <laughs> God damn. Bro, that shit ain't stopped. <laughs> <laughs> what size is it? Um, uh, three inch. Okay. Yeah, cause you, what kind of muffles you got? Factory muffles? Yeah, that's what's saving you. Cause that black one we saw at H day, that shit was. He got that ball type edge. That shit was too loud, bro. That shit was too loud. Want to stop muffles cause they lose back pressure when you change it off. And and right now that's good, right? Having that kind of back pressure, cause everything else gone. So you take that out, you ain't have no back pressure. No. Hmm. I mean, basically a Type R swap, fucking sedan. That shit slows it. I was riding on 64, let my car bank out, bang out, and fifth gear. I thought it was just gonna keep going fast. Hey, I wanted to. So, am I gonna seem like a little burn on the highway? Between who? Yo, I'm gonna tell you though, I'm proud of you with this car. Cause didn't you get this from from somewhere around here? Uh, Rapids. Okay. Yeah. It was the one that had a supercharger right there. Oh, um, yeah. that guy Alex Royals used to have. Yeah. So y'all just took it. They, who took it off? When I had first did trap and cut the bump and stuff, that's when me and him like had first met. 
like five years ago and that's why like the trap shit he got that's the same like the canjo style yeah. bro we was in love with that the no good racing <laughs> that's a good look anytime See, your boy should have came up here. He could have got some runs in. And not broke it, maybe. Yeah, he everybody out here. Yeah. <laughs> got to. <laughs> seen it somewhere. Oh, the one that came out that was KT. Uh, KT and me one day. Did you did you go yesterday? No, I didn't go there yesterday. But I, he did he invite? Yeah, he invited me to like a Honda cookout they had up in um, Tarboro. Oh, I seen I, that and, little thing. And I didn't never go because I was like, it, it, it sprinkled rain and shit. And I was like, I don't know. And then, I don't know. I just didn't never go. But I felt bad, though. Huh? Yeah, yeah. We left and I was like. A lot of is that it's a lot of bags shit out here. Yeah. Instead of crazy all this most of the stuff bags I like that color. Let Ant do them headlights. This is pretty I don't know why, but this is a pretty ass color in the SI. And four door. Yeah. I ain't mad at the forte. And this was the color that my um blue car was. Mm -hmm. But it wasn't quite perfect, but it looked like right. yeah. Four fifteen. Because with those stocks, bro, see everybody expect yours because of how it is. But with them stocks, that's all. I can't know I don't know why I thought that was really a police. This motherfucker here. It's weird looking at it with the hood on that bitch. I don't know. Woo, come on, man. This shit is hard, dude. That shit look like that shit look like my mama countertop, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Like the same one that was in Raleigh, though. Did it meet who was it? <laughs> That's a pretty ass color, bro.
So guys, that's pretty much gonna wrap this video up. Uh, before closing out, I just wanted to give y'all a little sneak peek into what I'm gonna be doing in the next video. So here is the full, well, the cat back exhaust from eBay for the uh, Daily Driver CG. We got it sitting right out there. So I'm gonna be getting that thing in here. We're gonna do the exhaust on it first and um, take it over, let my guy um, Dunny weld it up for me. Well, not this part, but make the front to the um, header. And then after we do that, we'll bring it back and we got a fresh set of max speed and runs coilovers. We're gonna throw on this thing, give it a nice stance. And um, yeah, from there, uh, hopefully we can go and get the interior done and um, assemble everything from the interior. We got a bunch of pieces just laying all around in the shop everywhere. So hopefully we can get the full interior reassembled and it should be good to go guys. It should be good to go. I'm scheduled tomorrow to tune the trap. Um, so if you watched the last video where we were working on the trap car and um, trying to get those injectors right, we're supposed to tune that tomorrow. So stay tuned for that video as well, but yeah, I'm gonna wrap this video up here, guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure you smack the like button. I will catch y'all next time. Remember, respect all bills. Peace out.